Democrats want to remove Trump from office because they hate him. That's the reason. If they get their congressional majority back, they will start that process on day one. They will have to do that because their base demands that they do that. Look at the polls. That tells you the whole story. Republicans, of course, are horrified by all of this, but they shouldn't be horrified by it. Unlike a special counsel investigation or sabotage by career federal bureaucrats, impeachment is legitimate. It is a constitutional process. If you think a president has committed high crimes, you impeach him. That's what the document tells us to do. You put him on trial in Congress, you present your evidence, you let the Senate decide guilt or innocence. There's nothing secretive about it or stealthy. It all takes place in public. It is a totally transparent process. Voters get to decide what they think, and then they render their judgment at the ballot box. Last time Congress impeached a president, voters did not like it at all. They punished the party that did it, the Republicans, in the midterm elections of 1998. That was 20 years ago, but Democrats, who have a long memory, remember it well. And that's why they're lying about their intent to impeach Trump right now. Democratic lawmakers act like the thought of impeachment has barely crossed their minds. Impeachment? Really? What? That's the same tactic they use with immigration and so many other issues. Hide their real goals and hope the country doesn't notice. Well, we have noticed. So let's have an honest debate about it.